Hi, so today we will be seeing the second part of the final year project that is building the rectangular microstrip patch antenna using defective ground structure. And this is also a pre-saved file as you can see and we will open this and this is the file this is top view and to see the bottom view we can see that we have created two structures of defective um, defects and uh, that is U and I and now I will show you the simulation of the structure so all things are set here and click OK OK so it is also uh, 1 MB RAM so it will take a bit of time so we have created here three bands you can see there are three at three points it is getting resonated at 2.38 2.36 right at 5.28 and at 8.6 so this band will be having uh, different purposes and uh, we can uh, like uh, 2.36 we have UMTS and in 5.28 we have IMAX and in 8.6 we have radars, radio locations helping in military things. So these are the other things as the applications which I have just spoken about. So multi-band serves different purposes and we can also see the efficiency is also good. For that we have to see the gain versus frequency this time. So this is the gain versus frequency. Uh, we can see at the point of 2.3 we can see it to be 1 point around 1. So it is okay and also at 5.28 it is quite good 6 and in at 8.64 also it is above 5. So these all three points are above 0 dB so it can it is quite good. And uh, we can also check their Z parameters or the other things. So this is how we create multi bands using defective ground structures. And uh, in the next part, we will be looking at circular patches and how we can create circular patches.